student loan payments. Relatable. <laughs> oh. Got broken up. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Quanta Buffalo and today we are playing Drake Hollow. Now Drake Hollow is a cute little adventure action game where you're looking after little cute little Drake Hollowy things. You'll see them soon. Now you can play this as multiplayer, single player, which is what I'm going to play as because I've got no friends or co-op. Now we're just going to create our character. We've just created our character. Isn't she looking beautiful? And got herself this awesome little backpack. So let's just accept and head on in. I can hear the wind in my right ear. <laughs> so from the cutscene that we had, we just got broken up with by Sam, who could be a girl or a boy. They didn't tell you that. And now I'm moping, following a crow that has a coin necklace. Alright, let's head on in. I like this music. Psst. Hey, kid. Okay, it's a little bit creepy that there's a crow talking to me. I'm just going to keep following it because it makes sense. <laughs> the graphics is awesome. I've got a different path for you. So I can't... Oh! So <laughs> it's going the way I wanted it to go. Hey, look, kid. I've been sent to find someone. And I think you're it. Forgot the X Factor? <laughs> the It Factor, if I will? This door I'm sitting on. Gonna need to walk through it. It's not strictly speaking a normal spooky door in the woods. Really more like a portal. Some folks on the other side can really use your help. Oh, well, it's hurting my throat, but we'll keep going. I can't force you to step through. You gotta do it on your own. But I'd appreciate you deciding fast. My brain's getting foggy the longer I'm on this side. Not gonna be able to stick around for much longer. I gotta warn you. This could be a one-way trip. No telling when you might get back. It's going to be dangerous. I feel like I should have given a bit more of a shrimply voice, but this is what we're going with. So you're up for an adventure? Step on in. I like this chill music. Let me move that mouse. I really should have got rid of the mouse in the cutscenes. <laughs> oh, okay. He didn't tell me that was going to happen. If he said, are oh, you going to get pulled through a deathly looking door with some vines that are shattered in red? I probably wouldn't have gone there. Oh, you still want to talk to me now, do you? You broke up with me on... Uh, was I sitting there for a whole day? I got that message on Tuesday and I was sat on that same rock. For eight hours? It's, that's, no, it's longer than eight hours. It's like 18 hours, isn't it? Have I eaten in that time? <laughs> I must be so hungry. Can I get a burger? Mozzarella burger would be much appreciated. So from the premise of this game, like I said, we're going to be looking after some cute little creatures. Oh, you're still on my throat. Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> ah, you made it. Much better. Head was fucking up something awful. No offense, but I hate crossing over. But if I'm being honest, I wasn't sure you'd cross. I'd been starting to lose hope. Seems like it's on short supply everywhere these days. Welcome to the Hollow. It seems better days, I'm afraid. That's kind of why you're here. Follow me, I'll clarify. I don't think I can keep the voice up. <laughs> I brought you here at the request of an old friend. Someone from your side of the hedge from way back. Okay, the person that broke up with me? Probably not. Probably best if you just heard from her directly. She left me this note. Okay. Dear Mr. Crow, I know how to help you and the Drakes. I need you to find a warrior, strong of will and body, sensitive to animals. Look for them when the hedge is thin. Bring them to finish what I am too frail to accomplish. They must work with the Drakes to build their power and seek out my effects hidden from the Terminer. Find them. It's the only way to save the hollow. Yours, Sarah How. But I don't know them. I don't think. So here you are. You've got that youthful vigour we need. The hedge was thin. And as evidenced by this here conversation, you got the gift of animal whispering. Okay, that kind of makes sense. Come on! 
I've got something I'd like you to try, and some folks I think you should meet. Ooh, look at that. So pretty. I was saying I was gonna I'm gonna be looking after little Drake hollows, cute little things. Uh but I've gotta keep them entertained, fed, so I'm essentially gonna be making them a home, a farm, because they can literally die of boredom. <laughs> Let's try awakening the crystals. I was gonna call them ruins, but they're crystals. So I'm so how was I just able to do that? Am I just like wake up? Wake up. Oh, hello. I think that's a little Drake Hollow. Oh, look at them. They're like Groot, but they're not trees. <laughs> Do you speak? Do you say I am hollow? Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. That's not good. I'm guessing they're the enemy. Okay, so they're giving me a branch. I'm guessing I'm going to whoop some ass with that. <laughs> 11 DPS damage points. Okay. Oh. I don't, <laughs> I don't know if that was meant to happen. I assumed the cutscene was going to happen regardless whether or not I swung. Woo! Okay, can't... Whoa! Yikes! Okay, that's one... Oh! One down. Come on, you little critters. Fiends! You hell spawns! <laughs> Nails? Oh, thank you. You've met our esteemed allies, the Drakes, and vanquished a pack of pesky feral. Not bad, kid. The Drakes are a companionable lot. Kind souls. Unfortunately, they've had a rough go. Ain't what they used to be. You're gonna need to do some legwork to earn their trust. The Drakes are pretty hungry and thirsty, hibernating so long. Unfortunately, land's no good. Everything that comes from the ground is blighted. Gather up some lumber and build a cleansing cauldron. Check back with me once it's built. And I'll tell you how to use it. Right, so I need to get wood. How do I get wood? Chop a tree. Do I just smack it? I literally just smack the tree. <laughs> I literally just smack the tree. I must be super strong to be smacking down some trees <laughs> with just a piece of stick. Come on, little buddy. You've got a cauldron to build. Ew. Yeah, that's not the slightest bit creepy. Look at those big ass arms. <laughs> I should say, they were quite thin, but those were some long arms. You're going to need to investigate this land a bit for a couple of things. Juice boxes and bane berries. Get at least four of each. Walk up to the cauldron and toss them in. Soon the berries and juice will be cleansed and the drake can chow down. Now they've got a meal waiting, should show them you're not looking to do them harm. Oh, okay, so I just need to break down um, random stuff to find <laughs> juice boxes. So I can destroy cars. Okay, let's head back. There you go, little buddy. You got some food. <laughs> that was cute. See, I'm friendly. You can help me out now. John Law found woodcutter. Oh, cool. So he'll cut some wood for me. Oh, look at it! It's doing the Naruto run. <laughs> Leave thatched beds and poppets around to prevent Drake from dying of boredom or exhaustion until you can build a more permanent structure. Without a place to sleep, Drake will return to their hibernation. Make sure there's always enough beds or you'll see your population plummets. Hello, do you have any charms? Hello! Ah, oh, okay, cool. Let's make a bed. The bed only lasts for one night. Wow. <laughs> so I need to go by the river to find cattails. Are these cattails? Wonderful. Oh, hello. I didn't realize that <laughs> that could happen. Can you attack him, please? A level three grunt. Ah, oh, you are nothing. You're weak. Oh, there's more. Hey, buddy. Come here. That's what I thought. Any more of you? Oh, a ski. Take the schematic. You can use it to unlock the ancient and arcane magic or arcane art of building a curio workshop. Go ahead. Try building this one. You're going to have to if you ever want to get out of this place. Let's just beat this rubbish. Oh! Oh my god. Right, let's unlock this. You have schematics? Yeah, let's spend our schematic. 
And let's build a workshop. Let's just put it right by the cauldron. Hold E. No, come on guys. Can you build this for me please? Do my bidding. <laughs> awesome. We need to get some more food for these little buggers. There's still drakes out there who need your help. Climb that lighthouse up north and take a look see. Where is the lighthouse? Oh, I gotta go. Okay, show me where to go. Have fun, guys. I'll be back. Right, how do I get over there? Do I need to swim? This isn't gonna... Oh! Oh, my God. Oh, hello. Oh, there's a drake in here. Hi, buddy. Oh, look at you. It's another Dilfer. Okay. Ooh. This must be something good. Oh, bricks. Okay, I'm guessing bricks are probably kind of rare. If they're that glowed up, they must be. Okay, there must be a music box or something in here. A page from the journal of a noble mason. Heretics be cursed. To date, five souls have come before our court, each accused by use of spectral evidence, questioned, and then sent to the maker. Some call such means of inquiry severe, but I say thee, if they will not confess in this life, they shall do so in the next. For who am I to begrudge the doomed their faith? Okay, you sound like a nice person. Hold to use nail gun. What do I need the nail gun for? Oh! <laughs> so I'm discovering more, I'm guessing. There's another... Is that another light lighthouse? Hibernating drakes found. Hold... Press M for the map. Okay, so we are at sis three sisters. Okay, pretty big map. Bad news, kid. Looks like all this activity has caught the eyes of the local grunt population. Best get back to camp ASAP. Hello, boy. Oh, two hits. That's what I thought. Are the, the Drakewoods fighting them? Or are they waiting for me to do all the work? I sure hope they're fighting. Alright, so they're not, they're not really doing much. Oh, they're hiding. <laughs> they're little cowards. Oh, what's this? Oh, they... They broke my table? You've proven it, no doubt. You've got what it takes. Here's what's gonna happen. You're gonna rebuild this place. Once that happens, they'll send you home. Simple as that. I warned you it might be a one-way trip, but I think you got this. What are you looking at? Are you looking at that? It's cute, isn't it? <laughs> okay, guys, I'm gonna end the video here. We made uh, a few beds so they have something to sleep on. <laughs> And a little bit of entertainment with their little poppets. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. It was fun making it. So thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I'll be seeing you.